Okay, so I'm gonna quickly answer uh, or, or uh, share about this question. Well, how is this helpful? What, how does this activity um, make sense for now, for the future? I've touched upon it uh, earlier, uh, but uh, one of the things I'd like you to do, uh, I'd suggest you to do is uh, take a couple of minutes, five to 10 minutes and write down your thoughts. How is this important? How is this beneficial? How will it help you? How will it help the community? Uh, write a few points, make a list of these points, and then have a group discussion of, about what you have written. Um, share it with the group and then, uh, uh, so from that, the essence of why this is important will already be available. Uh, but oh, above and beyond that, I, I, I can share a couple of things. Art helps in many different ways, in development of, um, of, of, of sharing, of, of uh, building community to uh, looking at our histories, documenting histories, documenting our uh, lives, our emotions, our concerns. It can be social, it can be political even in nature. It could be something that can be impactful to an individual, but even to society. Can we think of art in, in society that has really transformed society? Um, it has um, gone to even uh, create policy change. Uh, art has that potential. We have seen it in the past. It's even today art, art uh, plays a very ro uh, crucial role in shaping society, uh, shaping our ideas, giving new ideas. Uh, and in the future, we also look at how we reflect on history. When we think about history, what are uh, key elements, where uh, key events of our time that we look at and how can we see it through art? Uh, how does um, uh, old paintings, old murals, how, how, how does that tell us about the past? Today, when we explore Ladakhi history, uh, how much of it is through visuals, through photographs, through music, through poetry, through, uh, through uh, paintings? Um, on the other side of it, we also see a lot of significant art in religious, uh, in, in our religion, in our, in our communities, uh, where um, ideas of faith, I ideas of certain values are expressed through, uh, through art. So there's a whole length and breadth of uh, how art can be important, why art is important, how it can play a significant role, um, and even creating uh, what you'll be doing, creating um, art around in your communities, uh, it becomes uh, something of a, uh, something of a, uh, um, a memory for your community that on this date, in this time, this was created, and the whole village knows this is there, and it and it uh, communicates a shared value. It communicates a shared um, uh, understanding of of a certain uh, topic that you that you will choose. Uh, and, and it's a way of bringing community together. It can be a landmark. It, it can be, uh, you know, that red rock that I've painted. You know, it can be, let's meet near the yellow rock that, you know, is painted. It, it, it can have uh, that uh, uh, a memory aspect to it also, creating something memorable, not only for yourself, but for a community. Um, we look at, even in our landscape, we look at stupas and prayer flags. These are all markers. These are all. Uh, art forms essentially. Uh, of course, they signify different things, but they are artistically made. They're, they have aesthetic quality and they're informative. So, um, overall, just to share a couple of those things, but I, I'd like you to focus on the exercise also. Think how does this uh, activity help me, help our community? What does it communicate? Uh, and then uh, do share with the group uh, what you have come up with.